Good morning, guys. It is 5.15 a.m. on Thursday, November 3rd, 2022. It is vlog number 19. And, uh... Same guitar, same amp. I just love this little Line 6 Spider 520. I like my uh, Spider 520 Mark II and the other amp too, but I like to transition between all three amps. You know, one day I played this amp, and then the other day, another day, you know, play the Spider 520 Mark II, and then another day played the Mark II 60 version, 60 watt version, the Spider 5, so. Let's get to a different distortion channel. Just uh, using different effects on this amp, it's really nice. Really enjoy the flanger effect, the uh, delay effect, and the reverb and chorus effects on this amp. As well as on the Spider 520 Mark II and the Spider 560 Mark II. So, um, one day I'll get back to uh, filming with the Spider 560 Mark II. Um, But I got a lot of guitar covers coming soon. And I'll be using my capo to do the country songs. 
since a lot of country songs require you to use a capo. Unless of the songs use the open chords like your standard G chord, D chord, A chord, and E chord. So, but uh, thank goodness for capos. That's all I gotta say. And um, I'm keeping these little vlogs short and sweet. However, when I get my Zoom 2QN camera, I'll be able to upload more than 15 minutes per vlog, make them a bit long, you know, play my favorite songs for you guys. And, uh... Before I go, if you guys want to know what's next to the camera, this is the SoundLink Mini 2. This is what I use for my videos, for uh, doing the guitar covers. I've been using the Alexa on the... Um, Amazon Echo, that's to the right of me, next to the coffee pot, but uh, I use this a lot, I plug my um, iPod Touch 6th generation into this, you know, it's connected through Bluetooth, and I just play the songs off Spotify and just do my guitar covers that way, but um, just to show you guys, if you guys are curious, what's next to the uh, camera, it's the Sonic Mini 2, had it for 6 years, got it on August 2nd. 2016 and it's a really good speaker it's still good the little cover that I bought for it it's nice and sturdy over it and uh, speaking of covers um, I'm planning on getting the cover for the line 6 spider 560 mark 2 on Amazon I saw the 60 watt spider 5 cover so hopefully that one fits over the Mark II version of the amp. I don't think it's really going to make a difference because both models, the original Spider 560 and the Spider 560 Mark II, are the same exact size. So I don't think it's really going to make a difference. Even though on Amazon it says the cover is used for the Spider 560. So I don't think it's really going to make a difference if I put it over the uh, Spider 560 Mark II that I have. The reason why I want to get a cover is because when I take the amp places, at least it's protected from scratches and um, dust and debris and stuff like that. So. But uh hope you guys enjoyed this Thursday vlog. Stay safe out there. Stick around for more guitar coverage coming soon, as well as keyboard covers. Still deciding what to cover next for the channel. And uh, keep subbing to the channel, and when we get to 300 subs... I'll do the first uh, Q&A video since um, I didn't get any questions on the uh, Q&A announcement video for the 200 subscriber special Q&A, which is okay, you know, but let's get to 300 this time and hopefully we'll do a Q&A, but uh, links to my social media platforms are in the description of course and uh, stick around for more guitar covers and videos and uh, stick around for vlog number 20